Hello, my name is Simeon Neil Asher, and the trigger point we're exploring this week is the tibialis anterior muscle. So let's a uh, little search of the software. Great. Um, okay, so tibialis anterior muscle, classic muscle when looking at someone with pain in the great toe, uh, the big toe. Um, takes its origin from the, the lateral condyle of the tibia. Uh, uh, about a third to two thirds of the way down the tibia itself and from the interosseous membrane. And it inserts into the medial, medial cuneiform, uh, into the, the distal portion, and uh, some slips into the, the, the metatarsal of the first or the great toe itself. So uh, in terms of action, uh, it elevates or, or dorsiflexes the foot and it internally rotates the foot as well. Uh, classically, as we said before, there are two uh, sort of areas that we see in terms of trigger point pain maps. The main one is into the big toe, and let's have a look if we can have a look. It goes all the way under the big toe. Also, there's a little portion strongly felt in the anterior part of the ankle itself. Um, this muscle is, is, is quite vulnerable to certain injuries. Certainly, if someone's wearing a splint or a cast after twisting the ankle, uh, twisting inversion uh, and eversion strains of the ankle. Uh, people with high heel shoes that wear a lot of high heel shoes. Uh, explosive sports that use uh, the great toe to sort of uh, bounce up and down on. And in general, um, it's used for, for sort of ac activities that involve the great toe itself. Um, so quite vulnerable as we said to injury. In, in terms of differential diagnosis, of course, we know that things like gout, can cause pain in the big toe. But actually, interestingly, it's interesting, you, you can sometimes find uh, tibialis anterior trigger points uh, in people that have gout, and it can actually reduce the, the pain of the great toe pain as well, classically. Um, so the, the other things to look out for, apart from people that strain, uh, strain their, their ankle or toe, is, is skiing injuries uh, and, um, and certain sports injuries uh, as well. Um, another classic one, for example, is people on a diving board where they're bouncing up and down on their toes and about to dive. We often see trigger points in tibialis anterior there. Quite easy to treat, quite ready to treat. Obviously, you have to differentially uh, make sure you're not in the uh, extensor digitorum longus, which is very close to it. But um, it can be treated with uh, digital pressure or with, uh, with needling as well. So that's the tibialis anterior muscle. We hope you enjoyed that and look forward to seeing you next week. Thanks very much.